Alright, I got 14 minutes and 40 seconds. That's a pretty good amount of time. Let's talk for a bit. just want to talk a little bit. Um, not really sure exactly about what just yet. Kind of just turned it on and decided to start talking. Um, this is basically like my therapy, so... You know, you just talk about whatever you feel like in therapy, and... I kind of wanted to talk about certain things, okay, to be honest, but I, 14 minutes is not a lot of time. Let's talk about all of that, and really, it's probably for the best, because I'm probably just going to end up crying or wanting to cry, and I really don't want to cry anymore, like, I don't... I don't... Like, I'll feel better after I let it out, but then it, it, it eventually, like, comes back, you know, within a, a week or so, and I'm feeling, like, really, you know, horrible again, but... <sighs> yeah, it does help for a little bit, I guess, but I want to get to the fucking root of what's you know, going on within me and just, like, you know, deal with it and just transmute it and just move on from it or just categorize it in a different way within myself so that I move to, you know, move in a more positive direction in every aspect of my life because... I mean, I'm doing, honestly, I'm doing all the motions of, you know, building our career, our business, and building our stable relationship, and making sure my daughter's happy, and, you know, as best as I can anyways, and, you know, the steps that you're supposed to take in order to be a good, you know, a good, loving, supportive member of your family. Um, but m my heart is just, it's just so achy. It just hurts so much. And it's not to say that it's not in it, you know, as far as where I'm at, where I'm going with my family. Like, it's there. But it's just so, so... Brought with strife and pain and hurt that it that hasn't been you know fully healed essentially that I can't seem to be there in the way that I should fully you know for not just myself but my family, or not just for my family, but myself, vice versa, or whatever, you know. It's just... <clears throat> I'm just so depressed, like... I'm just so depressed, like... It's... I mean, like, I knew... You know, when I was a child, that adult life wasn't the most appealing looking, especially for people that are struggling financially. But, damn, like, I didn't, I don't know, like, I wonder now if people that I saw back then, you know, cried or felt the need to cry as often as I do, like, the need to, in order to just feel better enough to like feel steady and balanced to to cry for like hours at a time just to like get to that point like I really I really want to you know like just talk and let everything out like completely and cry just let everything not even talk like to anyone in particular just talk out loud to myself and just start crying and just purging it all out but it just takes so 
fucking long. It's just such a long fucking process. Like, when I'm in it there, especially at the, like, deepest parts of it, it's just, like, it's so, oh, my God, it's so draining, and it's just so, it's just time-consuming. And, like I said, at the end of it, you know, I, I feel better. I do. I feel a little lighter. You know, I might feel tired as fuck still, but I feel a little bit lighter and, you know, not as, I don't feel that negativity around me as much, you know, I feel more calm and more easygoing on myself and my family, like I have more patience with my baby and with Marco, with everybody, like in general, you know, and then just starts piling on again slowly, a little bit here and here, there and there, and just like. So, and I know it's not all just, you know, I know it's not all everyone else. Like, I know it's, it's me also. Like, it's, it's just not just me. Like, I know that it, it's happening, you know, there's this, a reason that this cycle is going on. And I just, yeah, I want to just be able to overcome that and just stay focused and just not worry about, you know, whatever I might say, how it might affect somebody else or how it might, you know, how they might perceive it. Because that's, that's like one of my, my biggest, I guess, problems that I'm trying to overcome right now is that I... I say things a certain a certain way sometimes that people take the wrong way and and it becomes an argument you know it becomes a disagreement a fight whatever and and I'm you know when it gets to that level I'm I'm not necessarily not at fault at all I mean I'm I'm engaging in that type of behavior and that type of form of communication, so obviously I'm fucking responsible too for the outcomes of whatever happens, but I'm not, I'm not a fucking saint, you know, <clears throat> I'm not, I'm a human being, and I have emotions, and I have my own trauma that comes into play once certain scenarios start playing out in conversations, and I tend to reflect those traumas somehow within what I'm trying to communicate to that other person or those other people or just outside in general and you know it's it's something that I I'm working on as far as like restructuring everything that I'm saying and making sure that it's not as toxic or you know judgmental sounding or accusatory or whatever other type of negative thing twist somebody wants to put on it or maybe may be able to put on it but you know there's just a part of me that just wants to say fuck that and just you know just say what the fuck I mean and don't give a fuck like if if you get offended or not and I'm I'm still like that to a point which is why a lot of people don't you know can't engage with me really or don't feel comfortable engaging with me really because, you know, I can get like that and it's, it's not good and I know that, you know, but like I said, I have my traumas, I'm trying to work on them, but I have nobody, I have nobody, I have no, 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 nobody that I can speak to except my fucking self, I'm literally my own fucking therapist, I have my own, you know, my own advice 
I give to myself when I'm watching my videos. From a more objective perspective. So, yeah. It's not easy. But I'm trying. And I have time still, but I want to be able to be in charge this time and have a few minutes to spare. So I'm going to go now. So I feel a little bit better.